Chapter 103 And now, I swear to you, the righteous ones, by the glory of the Great One, and by the honor of His sovereignty and His majesty, I swear to you that I know this mystery. For I have read the tablets of the heavens, and I have seen the writing of what must be. I know the things which are written and inscribed in them concerning you, because good things and the joy and the honor have been prepared and written down for the souls of the pious ones who have died. And manifold good will be given to you in recompense for your labors. And your lot will exceed the lot of the living. And the souls of the pious ones who have died will come to life. And their spirits will rejoice and not perish nor will their memory from the presence of the Great One for all the generations of the ages. Therefore, do not fear their reproaches. Woe to you, O dead of the sinners! When you die in your sinful wealth, those who are like you will say about you, Happy are the sinners, all their days which they have seen during their life. And now, they have died with goods and wealth, and they have not seen affliction and murder during their life. And they have died in glory, and judgment was not executed upon them during their life. You yourselves know that they will lead your souls down to the netherworld. And there, they will be in great distress, and in darkness, and in a snare, and in a blazing fire. And your souls will enter into a great judgment, and the great judgment will be for all the generations of the age. Woe to you! You will have no joy! For you, the righteous sacred ones who are living, did you not say, In the days of tribulation, we toiled laboriously, and we saw every tribulation and met with many evils. And we were consumed and became few, and our spirit is powerless. And we were destroyed, and there was no one to help us with word or deed. We were powerless and have found no protector of any kind. We have been crushed and destroyed, and we have been unable even to have hope of knowing salvation again from one day to the next. We had hoped to be the head, but became the tail. We toiled, we labored, and we have not been in control of our wages. We became food of sinners. The lawless ones have weighed down their yoke upon us. Our enemies were lords over us. And they goaded us on and penned us in and we bowed our necks to our enemies. But they have shown us no mercy. We sought to get away from them so that we might escape and find refreshment. But we found no place to flee and be safe from them. And we complained to the kings in our tribulation 
and cried out against those who cast us down and oppressed us. But they did not receive our petitions, nor would they grant a hearing to our voice. And they did not help us. They found no fault against those who oppressed us and devoured us. Instead, they supported them against us and assisted those who killed us and made us few. And they concealed their iniquities and they did not remove from us the yoke of those who devoured us, nor those who dispersed us and murdered us. And they concealed reports about those of us who were murdered. And they did not remember that they had lifted up their hands against us. <laughs>